Hello there, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show how to prepare bar and column chart in ArcMap. So for this purpose, I have to add here base map. I will add here OS Bengal shape file. Here in add data, here I have OS Bengal shape file in UTM. This is my shape file and see here in open activity table, I have male female population and total population and I'll show bar and column chart basically bar and column chart present a number of quantity field in an eye casing fashion so you can draw a layer with bar and column chart when your layer has a number of related numeric attributes you want to compare in my case I want to compare male population and female population district of coach Bengal but remember one thing, bar and column chart are useful for showing relative amount rather than the proportion and percentage. So it's a relative amount. Don't use percentage or don't use any uh, relative amount or proportions. Right? So let's start how to prepare it. Just simply go to this layer properties, right click over there and go to properties. And now go to this symbology. We can easily prepare from here. This, this is called chart. Just click over there, chart, and see the second option bar and column. Okay, so just select this male and press shift button female. Then this call in. So now see this is male and this is female. We can change color from here. Suppose uh, I want to give color instead of blue, I want to give color. Sub, suppose this one green color okay for female you can choose any color just I want to change this flame red right so now apply and okay now we have to customize it it's a bar we have to customize it many things suppose this is a background okay we can change this background color right uh, from here okay we can choose from here also if, if you choose this color we can choose from here also right so I have to choose this color just apply it and this most important part for part is see this is a column if you want to prepare it in bar then bar means horizontal bar right so just click it ok and ok now see it's a horizontal now one thing you can prepare in 2D or you can prepare in 3D. If you want to prepare in 3D then again you have to tick mark here display in 3D. Just click over there. Okay just apply it. Another important part is that size. Size is matter. So see in this case if you want to change the size uh, here maximum length 48 point. Uh, you can change chart for the size from here with spacing. If you want to prepare a bar diagram, it's, it's called histogram because there is no space. So if you want to give space, then you have to add space from here. Okay, from here, uh, space four with uh, six. And if you want to increase or decrease, then you can increase or decrease from here, right? So first of all, I'll show you how you can prepare a column chart. So it's a column chart now. And properties. See now here some spaces. I uh, I think green is not okay for me, so we can change again uh, other color like this. Okay, so this is a column chart. You see now this is a layer view. We can easily prepare this in layer view. And another important thing is level. So we can level it again. Go to here and go to properties and here level uh, or we can easily label it in name and just change it to 14 right click it ok yes I think it's ok now problem is that see in, in this case not so much we gonna show in many times so here placement properties we can change it to remove duplicate level and click it ok again and see now here one time uh, now we can uh, customize uh, this layout map 
in many way uh, for me so okay now uh, i think we should change the color again because i think it's not catchy color so it's very difficult to differentiate in both so yeah i think this red should be okay for me yes is the machine right check with this proper area yes it is okay now now here the insert button and we can add here not add you can choose from various arrow symbol available in our plan and you can place it anywhere but it's recommended always right and upper side and it's called full extent so we can increase this full extent and insert again and scale bar we can choose or fps or cgs format and this recommended for me uh, because it's a very good looking is good because it's a visualization mapping with visualization right so you should careful about that uh, and we can customize everything right and click it okay now see this is scale bar uh, we can again we can change right we can change from here our last tags here insert and we have to present here listen right so just click click over there but problem is that if you want to prepare a beautiful listen then you have to customize it again right click over there and go to properties and then we can customize it from style then we can choose from here okay. and click it okay and we can increase font size we can decrease font size right column diagram if you want to change to column to bar simply go to properties and just select it bar now i'll prepare to the bar so we can easily change it just click it okay thank you for watching this tutorial hope it will help in your research